This has been my first. G20 summit and the first summit of the world's leading economies since the United Kingdom decided to leave the European Union. It has been an opportunity to showcase Britain as a bold, outward-looking nation so we can be confident about the fundamental strengths of the UK economy and optimistic about the role we will forge for the UK, building on our strength as a great trading nation in the future. Britain has a proud history as a trading nation and we have long been one of the strongest advocates of free trade. And as the UK leaves the EU, I've set out our ambition to become the global leader in free trade. In my bilateral meetings, I've signalled our determination to secure trade deals with countries from around the world. The leaders from India, Mexico, South Korea and Singapore said that they would welcome talks on removing the barriers to trade between our countries and the Australian Trade Minister will visit the UK this week to take part in exploratory discussions on the shape of a UK-Australia trade deal. Later this week, I will chair a meeting of the Cabinet Committee on Brexit and International Trade to discuss how the government should pursue an ambitious trade strategy and to work out which markets we should prioritise. It's not enough just to take a hands-off approach. We need bold action at home and collective action abroad.